Yeah, I mean, everybody said at the beginning, like this is this is, it's well known within the industry that that uh, high school pitching is very risky because, you know, there are only so many bullets in every arm, and you have a long development path to get to the big leagues. Even, you know, Andrew Painter murdered their minor leagues last year. Just just crushed his way all the way up to Double A. Looked like he was going to be a stud. Hurt his elbow. It just it happens to to just about every pitching prospect. So. That's why you don't do it, but they did. They bucked the trend back then. They thought maybe they could get uh, um, a front of the rotation starter, and and now, I mean, the real question is: is will Job even pitch this year? I mean, three months would put him back in July or so, I think. Yep. But if it's on the 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 back end of that uh, timetable, he's not going to pitch this season, uh, and and that's the worst possible outcome for him because he's a guy who needs as many innings as possible. Yeah, and for the fans that are like upset about it. Like, even if you didn't want to draft Joe, but at the end of the day, the administration that drafted him isn't here anymore. So yep. what's what's the point in really complaining about it? He's on our team. We have to make what's best for him. He still has incredible upside as a pitcher, and I, I don't understand. Like, we're acting like like he, his career's over. Like, it, people are making it sound that way. Like, he, he might be back by the end of the season. What is he, 21 years old at this point? I'll be Younger. turning 21. I think, I think he turns 21 this year. I yeah. Think yeah. yeah. Like, I, I don't understand. Sure, I, you could be upset not drafting Meyer, but at the end of the day, that was a different GM, and there's not much we can do about it anymore. But I, you know what? I will say this. I, I will say I understand why the fans are frustrated because it just seemed like a bumbling thing that happened. The whole entire thing just seemed like it was a fumble, and that's where I think fans should be mad. Now, the for everybody that said they knew they were going to draft Meyer, I don't remember. I don't remember. I don't recall so many draft experts among Tigers Twitter or Facebook. But that's that's where I, that's where part of the cracks me up because all you got to do is go. Well, look look where he is. It's, look where he is on a prospect list. That's why he's better. Well, that's fine. And it look. I'm not gonna lie. We all. I we were just. I was showing Chris the footage from the draft night show where we were going. What just happened? And I was swearing in Spanish. You know I mean, it, 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 there's a part where I'm just like swearing, and, and Chris goes, "Oh, well, Roger's got to go in the pool now." <laughs> uh, yeah, I mean, we we had been told that they were going to go with Meyer, and then suddenly it was like, "Oh wait, no, they're going with Job." Um, yeah, I mean, that's the thing. Like, there's we've seen this before in Detroit sports. Uh, there was the Darko pick instead of Dwayne Wade and Chris Bosh and whomever else. Um, at the time, you know, people understood it like, "Oh, look at the upside of this guy," and but. In retrospect, maybe not, you know, taking the foreign guy who only played against the chair. Uh, but then, you know, it's like, you know, the Lions, the Lions took Terry Fair ahead of uh, Randy Moss because of, you know, they couldn't have a, a bad personality on the team. And it's like, you know, well, uh, that didn't work out well. But uh, time, we're, we're still, it's still way too early for any of that, right? Like, Marcelo Meyer hasn't done anything in the big leagues yet. Jackson Job uh, was going to spend all year in the minors anyway. So the worst case scenario, uh, I guess the worst case scenario is this is a horrible injury and he never comes back, but uh, we'll treat this like a normal scenario where he rehabs and comes back from the injury and maybe he misses a year. He's still in the big leagues by the time he's like 23, 24. 